How you doing? Welcome. Appreciate it. How are you? Meet Sam, whose current job as a Lyft driver feels weird. You're back. Is the result of his life taking some unexpected turns? I worked for the government for six years. You know, I went from like 85k and great benefits to, you know,、um, you know, changing my career around. Hi. Sharp suit. Thank you. So you know, I came back to school, and I'm, I'm in a copywriting school. You know, so I'm kind of all over the place. How's your day going? Not bad, man. Yeah, just chilling. All right. Yeah. Just chilling. Yeah, just chilling. I couldn't really do much. You know, I had、yeah. to had to prep up. You know. Yeah, I got the shave going, man. You know, this is an awkward situation. You know, I walk in,、um, I drive Lyft. Who throws in I drive Lyft as like a <laughs> a humble brag? Like, you guys ever heard of it? It's not Uber. It's Lyft. I hope I don't get stood up. I don't think you got stood up. <laughs> It's funny for someone with a lot of anxiety. I come off as a very confident person, but like everybody, you know, insecure.、Uh, you know, at times, you know, nobody wants to get rejected. Sam's date is Rachel, a medical professional. Hi. How are you? Whose life doesn't quite fit into the age of instant everything. I'm kind of a grandma. I feel like I live life kind of in a slower pace than everyone around me. I go to bed early if I can. Hi. <laughs> hey, how are you? Good. How are you? Good. Welcome. Good. Good. Thanks. You know, you see those old couples, and they're so cute, and they're holding hands, and the guy is like pulling out the chair. Whoever that guy is, as a younger person, is what I'm looking for. Not like Benjamin Button trapped in a smaller body, but. You know, just someone who has a good soul. Where's the grandpa? Where are they? Where are they? <laughs> Hello. Hello. Let me introduce、Hi. you. Hi. Oh, how are you doing? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Good. What's your name? My name is Sam. Sam. Rachel. Rachel. Pleasure. Yeah. You nervous at all? Yes. Yeah. I'm super nervous. Yeah. But it's cool. It's exciting. Yeah. Do you live in Chicago? I do. I live in Wrigleyville. Okay, cool. Yeah. I actually just moved here. So Where did you move for? I, I was in DC for the last seven years. Oh,、um, really? I'm like the Benjamin Button of careers. <laughs> <laughs> like I went. So, yeah. So like, you're it's like, like retired like, and now. Well, well, I'm trying to, you know. So. No,、okay. I I worked for the government for six years. You're just gonna go back to preschool soon. <laughs> <laughs> Have my mom nurse me. <laughs> <laughs> so it's really hard to find a guy who's a mix of adventurous and lazy. I think that's a good mix, honestly. Well, your table is ready. <laughs> Please don't use that. <laughs> that was a train of thought that shouldn't have happened. <laughs> well, I steak and crab for two. But I'm allergic to crab. You're allergic to crab? I don't know. <laughs> When I go on first dates,、uh, I have a very big personality. Uh, in terms of joking, sometimes that person either doesn't get it or I do it a little too much, and it, it is a weird situation. So, what do you do for fun? Last year and this year, I biked 40 miles round trip to the Chicago Botanical Garden. Very cool. Have you been on the Lakeshore Path? Yeah, I live like right off the path. It's super dangerous. Like Lance Armstrong everywhere. You're just they're like, flipped, like yelling at you, taking kids out, dog、yeah. running over dogs. I only kicked two kids. <laughs> yeah, you're like kid, get out of the way. The other three I put in my van <laughs> for dessert. No, it is really, <laughs> it is really. <laughs> Check, please. <laughs> so, what do you、uh, what do you do?、Um, I work at the Children's Hospital. Nice. For two cardiologists. Oh, cool. Yeah. I hate that question. What do you do?、Yeah. But、uh, actually, currently, I'm a Lyft driver right now. I bet that's really entertaining. It really is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Now I love writing, but I'm a I'm a、oh, Jesus. Oh, defied been, gravity there. <laughs> that would just got really awkward. <laughs> We got the salmon、oh, here. Thank for you. you. Absolutely. Are you an anxious person? Super anxious. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> Anxiety. My, my psychiatrist diagnosed me with OCD, I but I refused to believe.、OCD. I refused to believe it, and I told her to repeat it three times. I was like OCD, OCD, OCD. <laughs> When people think of like OCD, they think of like washing your hands, but you're like turn is, the light switch like yeah, on, off, on, which on, I do, on, on. but it's more about like the mind. Cause you're like you're second guessing stuff,、yeah. doubting stuff.、Um, I lost my train of thought. <laughs> <laughs> Redirect me on the you topic. <laughs> you know, OCD. Do you remember my name? Rachel. Okay. 
was just yeah, testing uh, you. Dude, that was an aggressive question, though. If I failed that answer... <laughs> well, I haven't dated very much. I was in an eight-year relationship. We met when I was 18, so... I, I don't know, it's fun to kind of get to know what it's like all over again as an adult. Are you close with your family? Your yeah, parents? yeah, totally. Awesome. There, your parents are together? They are. <laughs> That's a weird question. So your parents are together. <laughs> so are your parents together? Are yours? They are not. They got divorced, um, I don't know, I was really young. So. When you were young? Yeah. I haven't been in many relationships at all. Okay. A lot of that was probably like commitment phobia. You know, I've had a couple that have been like a few months. I haven't had uh, many relationships, uh, you know, last a while. I, th I feel like my self-sabotage would be, uh, I usually run away when the girl starts to like me, because there's obviously something wrong with her if she likes me. You know, sometimes they haven't been interested in me or I haven't been interested in them, but I just haven't found the, the good match yet, because it's tough. Okay, so you've been, like, dating on and off. Like, what do you want now? I just want to have someone that can, like, just sit in a park and just, like, chill for three hours and not have to, like, entertain someone. You know what I mean? Just... Me too. You look beautiful tonight. Hey. Oh, I never complimented you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Can I get these out of the way for you? Yeah, thanks. Perfect. I would go out on another date with Rachel because she laughed at my stupid jokes. And she was just fun, um, easy to talk to. I definitely want to see her again, and I definitely am going to see her again. I mean, if she'll let me, I'm not going to, like, break into her door. Yeah, so Where what are you are up we? to tonight? I'm not doing anything. Would you like to get an ice cream cone somewhere? <laughs> you can get two scoops if you want. Oh my god, how are you? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I'm okay. Excuse me. Thank you. Thanks, babe. Um, we can split this. I can get it. I can get it. How did the date go? I think we share a good, a sense of humor and a, a background of being like anxious OCD yeah. people who are looking for a simple time and yeah. Well, yeah, what's your number? I don't have your number. <laughs> But yeah, no, um... <laughs> you don't have to give it to me. Yeah, I'll give it to you. Yeah, no, I had a, I had a great time with you, Rachel. Um, <laughs> hey, I know this is awkward. <laughs> but I would love it if I you went will, on a second date with me. I will go get ice cream with you. Oh, okay. Is that not a second date? That's like a date and a half. Is that good or bad? <laughs> it's good. It's good because it involves ice cream. How do you get to two? <laughs> you decide that after ice cream. Like, calm down. <laughs> hey. Hey, what's your favorite flavor ice cream? <laughs> um, probably chocolate. Ugh, I'm not a chocolate fan, I'm vanilla. All right, bye-bye. <laughs> what a weirdo. Yeah.